Okay, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, lady, ladies and gents. Redress Right channel. And we need to talk to you guys. And the reason why we need to talk to you guys is because we need to get this channel up and going. Because I figured I might as well start promoting it because I gotta start doing videos on it. Okay, so let's what we're gonna talk about today. How many of you guys got mortgages and you got mortgage problems? I do. I do, sir. Oh, I do. Can you help me? Okay, tell you what. We are gonna help you. Hey! I got mortgage problems too. You gonna help me? Yeah, I'll help you. All right. Yeah, you just no, no, no. You go sit. No, no. All the way. Yeah, keep going. No, no. Keep going. No, you gotta keep going till I can't see you. No, no. Keep going. No, you're not far enough now. Keep going. All right, now sit down right there. All right, there you go. I'll help you in just a second. Oh, Lord, I shouldn't have asked that question. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. Let's talk about something, okay? If you got mortgage problems, yeah, 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 you can hear me. Just beep, beep, beep. No, 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 no. Don't talk right now. I'm talking to the people. I'll get with you in a second. Apologize, ladies and gentlemen. I was watching one of the videos. <sighs> the one I said I tried to keep it to myself. Whew, I did try to keep it to myself, y'all. Let me show you something, if you don't mind. We're going to go to this particular document. Now, what I'm about to show you is not being given to the public, but we're going to give it to you. Okay? The Federal Reserve has their own Office of Inspector General. This is where you file complaints. Now, I want you to pay attention because many of you don't know of this. Nobody else has told you of this, and nobody else has brought forth complaints on this issue. Why? How do I know? Just trust me. The Federal Reserve has told me that it's seldom used and nobody has brought it to their attention before. That's why they're taking so long to respond to me. This is the address. It's right here. This will be in the description. The whole letter. All you got to do is copy and paste it. The letter will be the description. The description for this video will be this letter. Okay. Dear sir or madam. Well, no, let's let, let's let Dave or one of them read it to y'all. I am writing am to bring writing to, to bring your attention your an attention issue I have been facing, facing with regards to the provisions, to the provisions of the Federal Reserve, Reserve Act, Act specifically, specifically Section 13, 13 subsection, subsection O, which provides, which provides for, advances for advances to individuals, to individuals partnerships, partnerships, and corporations on direct on obligations, obligations of the United, of the United States. States. The text of Section 13, 13 subsection, subsection O of the Federal, of the Federal Reserve, Reserve Act, Act as it was as amended it was in 1935. Subject to, Subject to such limitations, such limitations restrictions, restrictions, and regulations, and regulations as the Board, as the of, board governors of Governors of the Federal of the Reserve, Reserve System, System may, prescribe. may prescribe, any Federal any Reserve Bank Reserve may make advances, advances to any individual, to any individual partnership, partnership or, corporation or corporation on the promissory, on the promissory notes of such individual, individual partnership, partnership or corporation or secured, secured by direct obligations, obligations of the United States, States or by any or obligation which is a direct obligation of or fully guaranteed as to principal and interest by any agency of the United States. Such advances, Such advances shall be made shall for be made periods for not period exceeding 90, 90 days and shall bear interest, interest and rates and fixed, and fixed from, time from time to time by the Federal Reserve Bank, Reserve Bank. Subject, subject to the review and determination of the Board of Governors of the Federal Reserve System. System. I, have I have attempted to access, to access the provisions of this law by contacting the local Federal Reserve Bank, the Board of Governors of the Federal Reserve System, the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, CFPB, and the Federal Trade Commission, but have not received a response in the past six months. Via my, via my rights secured, secured by, the by the Constitution for the United, United, States, States, of America, United States of America, I have the right, I have the right to petition for redress of grievances and seek access, access to the provisions of the Federal, of the Federal Reserve, Reserve Act, Act, including, including Section, Section 13, 13, subsection, subsection O. I believe that I believe my rights that my under this law have been ignored and, and I am seeking your seeking assistance your in redressing, in redressing this, this issue. issue. Before this, Before goes, this too goes far, too far I, and I and others have used this provision of law in obtaining advancements, advancements from the Federal, Federal Reserve, Reserve and presenting and a promissory note as prescribed, as prescribed by the Federal Reserve, Reserve Act, Act Section 16, 16 paragraph, paragraph 2, which operated, which operated as collateral, as collateral and security, and security for, the for the advancement applied for. 
the local the Federal local Reserve federal agent receiving, receiving the promissory, the promissory note, note, and subsequently, and subsequently the, federal the Federal Reserve notes advance, which, which was to compensate, compensate them for the extension of credits as identified by the Truth in Lending Act statement, statement has failed to adjust the account balance. I don't believe this is an oversight of the local Federal Reserve agent and slash or their subsequent assigns, I believe it is intentional including the fact that they are trading the mortgage on the markets after the note has been satisfied which invalidates the trade and which could substantially hurt the economy of the United States government if it is allowed to continue. Please note, Please note that the United, that the United States, States Congress on March 9, 9 1933 amended the Federal Reserve Act and stipulating, and stipulating that my promissory note, note was to be receivable at PAR, this provision, this provision of law has not been amended in this respect and I must insist on access to this provision of law. Deposited as security, security and, and when issued when against the security, the security of notes, of notes drafts, drafts, bills of exchange, bills of exchange and, bankers and bankers' acceptances acceptance acquired under the provisions of this act, this act the amount the thereof shall be equal shall to be not more than 90% of the estimated value of such value notes, such notes drafts, drafts, bills of exchange, bills of exchange and, bankers and bankers' acceptances, acceptances so deposited as security. As security. Such notes Such shall notes be the shall obligations, be the obligations of, the of the Federal Reserve Bank, Bank procuring, the procuring the same, shall be informed, shall be informed prescribed, prescribed by the Secretary of the Treasury, of the Treasury shall, be shall be receivable at PAR in all parts, in parts of the United States, States for the same purposes as our national, as our national bank, notes, bank notes, and shall be and shall redeemable, redeemable in lawful, in lawful money, money of the United States, States on presentation at the United States, States Treasury or at the Bank of Issue. It is customary for agencies such as yourself to advise one ago and speak with an attorney. Please note that I have provided you with a copy of the law as amended by Congress. I do not need to speak with an attorney as to the law and its application, since the law specifically holds that it's the Federal Reserve that should be consulted of which I have done and they have force of their responsibilities respecting this law by intentionally discriminating against myself and others like me known as. Sorry, I have to correct two things. First, this is to go. And we're going to put and or consult with an attorney. And then Or suck. Okay, so let's do that again. Such as Such yourself as to yourself advise to, to go and, to and speak and or consult with an attorney. With an attorney. Please, note Please note that I have that provided you with a copy of the law as amended by Congress. Congress. I do not I need do to not speak need with to an attorney as to the law and its application, application since the law specifically holds that it's the Federal Reserve that should be consulted of which I have done and they have pursued their responsibilities respecting this law by intentionally discriminating against myself and others like me known as any individual. By denying, by denying us access, us access to provisions of, provisions of the laws of the, laws of the United, United States, States of America, of America and, I object. and I object. I would appreciate, I would appreciate your prompt your attention, attention to this matter and I look forward to your reply. Your reply. Thank, you Thank you for your time, for your time and, consideration. and consideration. Sincerely. Sincerely. Your, name. your name. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this letter will be underneath this video. If you have a home, if you have a car, if you have a student loan, you need to, and or if you've tried to do the application to the Federal Reserve for Federal Reserve notes, this is what you need to send in to the OIG department. That's how we bring attention to this, okay? All right, ladies and gentlemen, the problem is what many of you don't understand is, as you heard him say, since 1935, this has been the law. I apologize for that. I'll have to get back with that person and speak with them in a moment anyway this has been the law it says any federal reserve bank may make advances to any individual that's you on the promissory notes of such individuals this is a guarantee by the u.s government i.e a direct obligation of the united states why because the united states has stated this upon deposited upon well deposited as security and when issued against security of notes drafts business change bank acceptances acquired under the provisions of this act the amount thereof shall be not greater than 90 percent of the value of such notes drafts bank acceptance bank acceptance uh, and so forth 
deposited as security. And such notes shall be obligations of the Federal Reserve procuring the same and shall be in the form prescribed by the Treasury and receivable and redeemable. Okay? That's a government guarantee. So that makes it a government obligation because the government has said that this is what it's going to amount to. So, ladies and gentlemen, in less than 11 minutes, this is for you. My hope is that you take and you do something with it. Now, some of you are going to want to add a whole lot of other junk to this. Ladies and gentlemen, it's less than two pages. There's no reason for you to add anything else. It has a slot up here for your information. You can add everything else by attaching relevant information. But my suggestion is you don't do anything to the document. You leave it at is, at ease, at ease, at ease. Okay. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Here is your letter. Have a good day, y'all.